Hello, welcome to another video. Peace be upon you, and I thank you all are well by the grace of Almighty Allah. Today, we are going to learn about uh, how to add horizontal legend in ArcGIS, and uh, I think this is special for you. If you have any queries, then uh, uh, leave your comment in the comment box below and uh, uh, watch the video until the last second. So, let's start. First of all, we have to select a blank map, then OK. Uh, after that we have to select shape file and data for our work then you can select your data from the plus sign here add data if your folders are not connected then you can add your folder by clicking here connect to folder then you can do your work uh, i want to select my shape file first for this i have to click here on shape file and then i have to select my shape file i have to click add and then I want to select my data for this shape file. This is my data. I have to add it. Sheet 1. Okay. After that, display XY data. Then you have to select the Z field. Uh, I want to do this uh, for 10 minutes. Then I have to select my data. Uh, this is my file name, 10 minutes. Uh, I have to select it. Then OK. After that I have to select here and then select data export data. You can change the file name from here if you want. I don't want to change uh, my file name. It's ok. Then press ok. Ok. My data are exported. Uh, and if you want to delete it then you can remove it. Ok. I want to add horizontal legend. For this I need to select here ok ok <clears throat> and uh, then you can you can change or you can change this uh, size by You can change the size by clicking um, here. Okay, no matter. Uh, we have to select the we have to select you can change the size of your map by clicking here I want to increase okay you can also change your image shape from here okay uh, and now I want to add a legend uh, for this I have to interpolate my data for this I have to click here uh, for arc toolbox then special analyst tools interpolation IDW ok then input feature this one ok Z field value 10 minute ok uh, raster Okay, then you have to click on environments and then you have to click processing extent same as layer and then you have to select your raster analysis maximum input and mask this one okay 
okay then you have to select ok your data will be interpolated and if you have interpolated your data then you can uh, go for further process or you can add legend for doing interpolation uh, my data are already interpolated you can see here a green tick mark and uh, there you can see IDW export 01 if you click here okay I if you uh, if you deselect it then you can see the actual image okay uh, now I want to add a legend here then you can select your legend from insert option okay I want to deselect it okay next legend okay okay finish here you can see my legend uh, it is not horizontal but I want to add legend horizontally for this I have to select it properties okay uh, I don't want this name items style properties general show layer name show symbol bar 45 and 0 0 degrees apply ok ok layout ok all are fine apply here you can see my legend are already uh, already I, uh, we, I have got my legend horizontally and I don't want uh, this this writings like uh, title or the values I don't want it then I have to re I want to remove it so how can I remove it you you can see ungroup okay then I want to delete this data okay I don't want these values I want to delete this one okay after that I have to group it then I want to make it long and lengthy okay thus you can add your horizontal legend in your maps and you can also add anything like like the north button or you can also add scale to your maps by clicking insert here scale text you can select your scale from here and if you want to add any text then you can text here any title you can select from here then you can also you can uh, also many things from your uh, from this option hmm. here you can find many other options so guys thank you for watching and hopefully this video will help you and if you want any tutorial like this then you can uh, knock me or you can leave a comment in the comment box below and until next video thank you